has succeeded Bill Clinton, becoming the 43rd president of the United States. And the inaugural celebration continues late into the evening. You're looking at a live picture of the Florida ball down in Washington. We understand that the president and the first lady have just left that event. Steve Handelsman tells us about this historic day for George W. Bush. Freezing rain didn't dampen the spirits of the new White House tenants. The president and the first lady went out to party. At every inaugural ball across town, the Bushes were the guests of honor. I cannot wait to begin to work tomorrow. He was father into America's highest office. His eyes glistened. The nation's differences run so deep, Bush said, so that 